This is the Bay Area's news station. Cron 4 News starts now with breaking news. They're still staging at the community center off of Tokyo Road. Stunning images caught on camera from the city of West Texas after a massive explosion at a fertilizer plant. Mass casualties being reported tonight. Right now we are learning much of that city has been evacuated. Grant Lotus is here now with the very latest. Grant. Pam, a massive explosion causing historic destruction. The small city of West is about 20 miles north of Waco, about 80 miles south of Dallas in Texas. We'll fly in here for a closer look. This is the fertilizer plant right here that exploded. The impact felt in all directions, leveling a middle school, homes including an apartment building, a nursing home, and more residential homes here north. Officials say a four to five block radius from the fertilizer plant has been wiped out. Take a look. We showed you the video of the actual explosion caught on camera. Firefighters were fighting the fire at the fertilizer plant when one of the fertilizer tanks exploded. You can see it. The images are just stunning. The mayor of West says it sounded like a bomb went off. He estimates 70 to 80 homes are destroyed tonight. Earlier tonight, the West EMS director estimated as many as 60 to 70 people have died, including five firefighters, one police officer. The mayor and other officials there have not confirmed anything except to say multiple fatalities have occurred and more than 100 confirmed injuries. Right now, firefighters and other first responders are going home to home looking for potential survivors that will continue through the night and into tomorrow. You can see that massive fire right there. And then this is a school football field that was transformed into a triage area, but that area was moved further from the fertilizer plant for two reasons. One, there's concern a second fertilizer tank could explode and the fertilizer chemicals in the air could be hazardous. First responders are currently wearing respirators to give you some idea. Here now, what it was like to be in West earlier tonight. It was like a bomb went off. Uh, we didn't really know what happened at first, and we got lots of broken windows and stuff. And I walked outside and saw a big uh, cloud of smoke up in the air. The rest home has been seriously damaged. We have many people down. Please, please respond. It was on fire. It was a real heavy blaze, and then just all of a sudden, it just exploded, and it blew everything within. What, 50, 50 feet, maybe a lot farther than that, back. You can see the roof here of this house, uh, the ceiling, I should say, that is completely caved in. All of the windows were blown in. Do you have a rough number on how many lives have been lost? I do not know right now. It's, it's going to be a it's going to be a number. You know, I can't give you a number right now, but there is going to be a number out there. Hopefully at 6 a.m. we'll know that. So Early estimates are 50 to 60, 70 maybe. I cannot confirm or deny that. I mean, that's, I just I wish I could tell you something, but I do not have that number. This story continues to develop and come daybreak. The images are going to be stunning. We'll certainly stay on top of this. We'll bring you updates throughout the newscast tonight. Pam.